What's going on everybody? Chase with iDev Hockey, here to do a review on the new Warrior Super Novium Hockey Stick. Now this is top of the mountain in the new Novium line. Insanely lightweight, but it still has that signature mid kick, courtesy of the bevel taper. So great for those elite level players looking for maximum power in a seriously feather light package. Now, as we get into shaft and shaft feel here, we have rounded corners, straight sidewalls, and that's done very strategically for this Novium line. For those big shooters out there that are putting and applying a lot of force into their shots, you really need a square shaft. And this allows you to great, get some great control so it's not twisting in the hands and giving you any of that inaccuracy. We have a raised texture all the way throughout. Might be one of my favorite on the market right now just because of how aggressive it is. And it really plays well with that lighter grip coating. So definitely not a super tacky finish a little bit more of a medium grip, but combined with that raised texture, it feels pretty stinking good in the hands. Now, in terms of the construction and materials, this is where we see their new RL or really light 199 construction. That's a true one piece design utilizing Minimus Carbon 25, which is some of the best carbon fiber Warrior has ever used and it's the most advanced construction process that they've ever used too. Really intense and strategic layering of the high performance fiber. And the reason why they did this is because they got this down to 333 grams. Mid kick, tons of power, absolutely ridiculous. Uh, and visually looks awesome too. And we'll get to that a little bit later. I mentioned mid kick stick, great for those power shooters. And that's really courtesy of the bevel taper here. So compared to a traditional shaft design that has straight sidewalls, we have indentions on both the forehand and the backhand. This creates a much better stiffness profile in the lower third through the taper because you need to get a really stiff lower portion to have the stick flex in the middle part, hence the mid kick point. But this utilizes less carbon fiber than a traditional design. So not only is it giving you that high power release, but it's also going to be very, very lightweight too. We have the Fuel Core T blade, and this is again reserved for the top of the line models here. Uh, it's a polymer construction. We have reinforce, reinforcements through the heel. Uh, we've got insanely lightweight but great feedback foam. So you know where that puck is sitting. No matter if you're in traffic, whipping out some technical dangles, it has some great feedback and feel to it. Um, and then it does have a textured finish too. This is where we get to the look and the feel. I'm gonna just talk about the feel again because 333 grams in a mid kick, it's absolutely ridiculous. It feels so good in the hands. Uh, they're gonna spoil a lot of people here. For those elite players that you know are looking at these price points, this has gotta be the best mid kick stick of the year. It's, it's absolutely insane. It looks absolutely sick, super dark from top to bottom. The iridescent foil is just shining throughout. Uh, the team at Warrior absolutely knocked this one out of the park. But if you're looking for even more information, go ahead and hit the link in the description. Give us a thumbs up on the video. While you're there, make sure you're subscribed to the number one hockey gear view channel on YouTube. See you next time.